All right, cool. So we have the drums. So let's hit play. Right. I know it's a little bit off on some. I think it's because I. Let's see. I'm gonna actually show it. Off the okay, cool. So there's the drums, right? So I'm gonna hit stop. When you're done with something, undo record. Okay. The R is for record, the M is for mute, and the S is for solo. Okay. Okay. The reason why I would say, you know, if because when you record something, anything, it's gotta the R's gotta be on red. It's gotta be on. It's record enabled. Okay. So undo the record enable. Can you just do it from here too? Like record or unrecord kind of thing? You can't, uh, you can't, like, unenable it and enable it. No, if I hit record, it's going to record it, but if I hit stop, well, I guess you can. Shit, didn't see that. Why not? I never did that before. This thing is still new to me somewhat. So. Yeah. Okay. Very new to me. <laughs> so... Cool. Okay. All right. So... I'm gonna put in like another sound. So I'm gonna get a new software instrument. Right? Okay. Create. And now I have my second one. Um, now here you can like choose, you know. Wait, oops. Did I just do that? You totally did do that. Sorry. That's no, okay. I'm gonna keep it on video. Um, so this will pop up. See, the media is where you can choose. You, there's, there's a couple ways of doing it. Okay, you can either hit media and choose from here what you want. Okay. Or you can just, you know, go down here to the I.O. Left, okay. left hand side, and you're going to get the same things if you look at them under the same ones. Okay. Okay. So. Is that the way that you prefer the I.O.? I do the I.O., like? yeah, but, okay. you know. So, like, let's see. Uh, I'm going to go here. I'm going to choose, I'm going to choose uh, ES1, which is Synthesizer 1. Okay. You can just click on this. You don't have to go here and choose one or shit. Just click on this. Okay. So that really doesn't matter? The yeah. The stereo or anything? Okay. And then that comes up. Right? Okay. Okay. So, here, keep this. Wait, okay, that's. They're both normal. This is, I still haven't learned this one. Like okay. This one's supposed to be in the middle, I guess. Okay. Um, what I would do is see these arrows right here. Uh huh. They let you choose the different types. Oh, fantastic. Okay. And if you want to go down an octave, octave down and up. So you hit yeah. down. Yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Great. So. That's cool. Sound, so I'm just gonna. Keep So I'm going to go ahead and add it on there. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to hit record. Actually, what you want to do, like, say, see this? See, like, if... if. So that's able to... These arrows allow me to just... Move around. Okay. So now I've got that line there. And now hit stop. Hit, hit no, no, no. Okay. You're always going to record at the beginning. So hit stop twice. Okay. Boom. You're Very back cool. at the beginning. Okay. So now... One, two... Three, four. Okay, so I kind of let, let the ball go on that one. But you get the point, cool right? Sound. It is. I'm it's telling you, like, cool. just the stock sounds on this motherfucker, like, you don't, I mean, you don't need... You don't have that on Ableton. 
I mean, you have it, but not. You have it, but you have to go it. looking for it. Like it's not it's just not there. <laughs> you know, it's like you have, sure, to, sure, you have sure. to be like, oh, where is it? Oh, maybe it's this one. Like, no, fuck it. It's that simple. It's you like, don't even know how many times I've hit a wall. It's so, okay. So watch this. <laughs> Two, three, four. So see how I recorded that one bar? Yes. Boom. That's that easy. Now let's hear it. Okay. Oh, right. Okay, remember what I told you? How the first one's not going to hit? Unless it's... Okay. Unless, because look, watch. I hit play. That's right. See how it skips it? Yep. If you look right there, it's actually after the green line. See? So... And actually, instead of moving it, what you can do is go to the beginning of it and you see that? See how it has a little bracket? Yes. Now it's not before the line. Okay, okay. Okay. Now here's the thing. Like Ableton, you can't have all of these the same level. Otherwise, it's going to sound, you know... What do you mean? Yeah, like, you know, mixing the levels. Remember the name yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what I want to do is go to Mixer down here. Okay. Okay. And I'll hit play. See how I'm sort of leveling it out? Because some sounds are louder than others. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, very cool. So basically, what you have to do is you have to go to Mixer to be able to do... To level, for the levels. Okay. It's kind of like, yeah, it's the same thing as Ableton. You know, you hit tab, yes. same thing. Okay. Except here, you can see both of them, actually, if you want. See that? Oh, that's cool. Okay. It's way cool. Careful, careful. Okay, cool. So I have that right on. So I'm going to hit stop. Okay, so we got yeah. that. Cool, we got the low end. So let's say I want to put in a, a high end. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go again to plus, software instrument, create. I'm going to get rid of the media. You can use it. How, how, you need to use it enough to where you sort of start to be like, sure. oh, I want to use that. No, I want to use that. Okay. And you eventually pick it up. You eventually pick up your okay. own style on it. So cool. Uh, I O. fuck, I don't know what all of these do, so I'll fucking... No, fuck it, go with the first one. You need to just fuck around and, and explore what, what each one has, because each one's going to be different. So let's see. Thanks. See how they all say pad? So it seems like that's a pad. We already have a deep bass sound. So you can actually click here and go down to here. See that? Leads, pads, bass, keyboard. Okay. Uh, let's see what this does. That's kind of an all kind of a cool alternative, dude. Because you got that low end sort of like. And if it doesn't work, you just go back and you delete it. Sure. Okay, so I'm gonna go again and I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. One, two, three, four. that. Boom. I loop it. Fantastic. Go to play. So it's not perfect, but you get the point. Oh, get the point. As a matter of fact, I actually want to redo that. Okay. Cool. So I'm going to go stop, stop twice. Can you take off record? Let me see. It's not off record. I know, but do you... No, I'm going to record again. Okay. I know... Okay, what I don't understand is... Sure. The recorder is still highlighted right now, but it's not recording anything. What does that... Is it that mean it's just enabled? Correct. Like ready? Record okay. enabled. Yeah. Okay. So when you hit record, because if, you know, normally if you hit record, it enables it itself. 
Okay. Yeah, if it's red, it means it's record ready. Put it that way. Record okay. ready, unhighlighted, not record ready. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to go back. Two, three, four. See, now it's not making noise. Yeah, it's on the other sound. Hold on now. So just just to say, here we go. One, two, three, four. Cool. Okay. I recorded it. So now Very cool. loop this guy. teach you something new. Okay, so say I got this and I'm listening to it and I'm like, yeah, it sounds cool, but most most songs have like a sure. go open or close hi hat or a shake right. or something. I'm like, well, I already have a different element. Yeah, this. I already have Ultra Beat on okay. here. So I go, you know what? I want one that has the same exact. Instead of hitting plus, you hit plus right here. Okay, neutral. Oh, okay, okay. Boom. Wow. Right. Okay. okay. So how did you get that to copy the ultra beat and not the other sounds? Like I don't, I don't understand that. Like because what I did was this, and I'll show you. I highlighted the drums, gotcha. which has okay. ultra beat, Fantastic. and I simply went bada bing boom boom. Okay. Now I'm gonna do something different, which is cool. I'm actually going to use Ultra Beat instead of just the sounds in Ultra Beat to keep the t -t 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 consistent. Okay. Okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually see where it says Ultra Beat. Mm -hmm. Double click on it. Boom. And now I'm going to go here and, and go. Oh, cool. Okay. Why the first one? That's cool. This one? Cool. That's so then I'm right? just going to go all the way across. And it's going to do this. What, dude? Yeah. That's insane. Yeah. But it still hasn't, and that's, that's what I'm going to show you, is it still hasn't recorded anything on there. And I'm going to teach you how to get it on there. Okay. But it sounds dope, right? It sounds dope, dude. See? But, so, okay, I want that sound on there. Okay. I'm gonna hit stop twice, it's gonna go to the beginning. I just learned this a couple days ago. Keep in mind, I've only started to use Ultra Beat since I've had the MPK. Okay. Because the MPK just fucking makes it like worse. So it. easy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What you do right now, I haven't even done any of this stuff and how you're using like the functionality of these buttons. No, like, oh, we'll go over it. We'll I'm just it. getting a fucking heart on over that. It's like, cool, man. Like, Dude. It's cool, we'll go over it. Here, here's one thing you might not awesome. have actually done yet. I'll show you. Ready? How did you do that though? Like how? So tiny. So. We'll get into that later. <laughs> okay. So, so I have. So I have this, right? Okay. Okay. So this is what I want. I want to get this. How do I get this on here? You know, you're thinking like, yeah, hey, yeah. What the fuck? I need, I need the pattern in there. Sure. So what you're gonna do actually is you're gonna go right here. Okay. See this little box right here? Yes. See here it says drag to arrange window. Yes. You're gonna hold down on it, and you're gonna literally bring it. That's, and then just and extend that's it. it again. And just get rid of this and extend the fuck out of it. Boom. Wow. And then I go dot dot. Now 
now I'm just gonna have fun with it. Now I'm gonna have a little bit of fun with it. Cause now we have we have yeah. the drums, we have the shaker, which the shaker is so important in like all the, a lot of songs. Mm -hmm. We have the sneaky synth, which is the low end, and we have the church organ, which is the high end. So now I kind of want to get a little bit creative and go. All right, cool. Well, I'm gonna start a new track. If it puts it in the middle, you can just grab it and bring it down. And I'm going to put Massive in there, just, just for the fun. Just for fun. Just for fun. Sure. See, I don't even remember using Massive at all with what I used. Okay. I remember just using it for like the wobble. Dude, what sound did you use for the wobble? I made it. I know, but how? I want to learn that. That's a whole nother class, my friend. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's fucking with all of this. I need to learn that. <laughs> I gotcha. <laughs> So, I mean, that that's just an example. I'm not sure that it'll work perfect, but just to fuck with it. Sure. sure. Three, four. recorded that I'm gonna extend the fuck out of it to right here and then what I'm gonna do because it's not gonna sound good all high and shit and bring it down and then go first part of it I think it's over the line yeah I'm sure it is I'm sure we gotta check that real quick and you're right so you get that little arrow you bring it right to the line 